Hello everyone, I'm Trevor Reaper, and today I've got a spicy review for you. I know it's been a long time since I've done a, a spicy review, and uh, sorry about that, but I'm back again, starting to get back into hot peppers now, hot sauces, and um, I got something really special to review and uh, it is the extra hot version of Reaper Squeezems. Reaper XXX Squeezems by Puckerbutt Pepper Company and it's even signed by the man himself Ed Curry as you can see it says Smoke and Ed 19 on there, the creator of the Carolina Reaper, and supposedly this is the hotter version, it's 50% hotter than the normal Reaper Squeezins, so I'm excited to try it. Um, the ingredients are Reaper peppers, distilled vinegar, and Reaper pepper powder, and that's it. So I heard that this is like 92% pepper, um, that's pretty much all pepper right there, it's like liquid reapers. Um, the description says on here, grower, harvester, and producer of great tasting and all natural pepper products including hot sauces, jellies, mustard, salsas, seasonings, seeds, and plants. Home of the world's hottest peppers, Smokeheads, Carolina Reaper. So, this came to me all the way from Fort Mill, South Carolina, and I'm about to try it. So let's open it. I'm going to shake it up first. Now, I already opened it because I had my friend from work try it, and uh, he says it's very hot. So... Ooh. Mmm. Smells good. It kind of smells a little salty, but there's no salt in it. But it smells. Uh oh. I got some on my nose. That ain't, that ain't good. Um, I'm gonna try to wipe that off. Um. Anyway, and it's such, it has such a good smoky um, smell to it. It smells like just, just like all pepper, all reaper there. Yeah, it smells pretty good. Anyways, I'm going to be trying this on a chip. Um, so the thing is about my, what my reviews, normally people would try a whole tablespoon of this stuff, but um, with me, I'm not quite that much of a chili head, to be honest, but I'd like to be, but I mean, I don't really go to extremes like having whole tablespoons and, and you know, drinking hot sauces, like, straight from the bottle, like, like um, Johnny Scoville does. But so I'm just going to probably just do a dab on a chip and I'm going to tell you how it is. So basically this is going to be how the average person will be towards an extreme hot sauce like this. Um, I'm used to hot sauce, hot stuff. I mean I used to be a real big chili head but I mean wasn't an extreme chili head. I was just more of like um, an average Joe kind of guy but anyways let's get into it it's thick very thick alright that's all I'm doing I know 
However, if it's not, if it doesn't get too hot for me, I'm going to try more of it, okay? But I'm just going to start off with this. Uh, it's been a long time since I had something this hot. Let me tell you. I have milk with me in case it gets too hot for me. But, um... Oh, man. <laughs> this is supposed to be 50% hotter than the normal Reaper Squeezins. So, without further ado, I'm Trent Reaper, and this is the Pursuit of Fire. Cheers. He creeps up. He is creeping up. The heat creeping up. Wow. Intense burn. Oof. It stings stings. It feels like it's burning my mouth to a crisp right now. Wow. That little bit packs in a lot of heat. I don't think it's peaked yet. I'm already sweating. Endorphins kicking in. Feels like it just... I'm gonna try to go five minutes. Wow, my mouth's on fire right now. That little bit. No way I'm doing a whole tablespoon of that. Great flavor, though. Wow. All my tongue, my whole tongue feels a bit numb. I'm sweating. Um... I don't know if it's peaked yet. Oof. Oh man. Wow. My mouth is tingling. Mouth is tingling. Woo! Oh my. Wow. Hands are tingling. My hands are tingling. Alright. Oh shit, I spilled all milk everywhere. Okay. I have anxiety, so... Guys, please bear with me. I just spilled milk, a little bit of milk everywhere. Please bear with me, guys. I have anxiety, so I'm afraid that this might trigger an anxiety attack. Wow. I've never had a hot sauce that, that made my hands tingle. That's bad. Mm. 
That is one badass sauce right there. Holy mother of F right there. I don't know if that's normal for somebody to, oh my, I don't feel very good. I don't feel very good. Um, I don't know if I have respiratory issues, but hopefully, Hopefully I'll be okay, guys. Um, my anxiety is going up right now. Um, I just have this real fear of something going wrong with my body and I might die. So that's just what my anxiety is rooted from. I don't feel very good right now. I'm feeling very nervous. Oh man, shit, that just lit me up. What's crazy is that it's really hot. Well, it is that hot, but the, the thing about it though is that it gives me this real rush. This like anxiety, I have nervousness right now, just really hoping that, um, that, um, that this isn't dangerous or anything like that. Um, uh, I'm kind of shaking right now, a little bit shaking. Please leave a like down in the comments below. All right. Um, let me, um, contact poison control. My body is shaking right now. I'll be right back, guys. Okay, so I'm back. Um, wowzers. Wowzers. This, my friends, is one hardcore hot sauce. Beware of the Reaper. Um, I still feel a little bit out of place right now. Um, my, I guess it just probably it triggered my anxiety and I had a little bit of a panic attack because my hands were shaking. Um, my, I felt a lot of nervousness in my arms and legs and I just didn't feel like walking. And so um, I guess it's probably because I haven't had something like this before in a long, long time, so my body was probably like, what is this stuff? So, um, yeah, uh, so I didn't end up puking or anything, um, I just had a panic attack, I think, I think that's probably what happens when people like me probably have panic, panic disorder, but, um, but, um, great sauce, man, I mean, like, wow. It packs in a, just a ton of heat, and even just a little bit, it just like, it's just, it, the kind of burn is just like, um, it just like, like, like ferocious, like kind of like aggressive, it has a very like aggressive burn, and um, it's definitely the hottest thing I've ever had. Um, Wow, but and what's really weird is that it seemed to have peaked. Um, it peaked and then like as it went away, or because I'm not feeling any burn right now, any burning sensations, none in my throat right now, because um, it all went away. But 
I still felt like I was having a panic attack. Like I was having, like something was like, this just inner fear of like something's going to go wrong with my body and that if something goes wrong with my body I might die and that's, you know, it's just the fear of death. Um, yeah, it made me fear death right there. Um, even though, you know, probably was nowhere near, um, an actual near-death experience, but, but, um, it was probably just my anxiety telling me that, uh, but yeah, guys, be careful with this hot sauce, um, props to you, Ed Curry, thank you for sending me this, um, um, it is a little bit expensive, but I think it's pretty worth it, especially if you're a chili head, um, I love that, um, it's signed by Ed Curry, uh, Smokin' Ed 19, um, so that's really cool, um, yeah, um, I'm probably will be doing videos of me and my friends trying this in the future, so stay tuned for that, um, anyways, um, be well, take care, we'll see you guys in the next video. <sighs> Cheers.